I bet you've heard the same thing I heard just the other day. Two people were talking, and the one said, well, the trouble with kids today is they ain't got no respect. Well, that may very well be true, uh, except I'm not quite sure what that means. So I listened a little bit more, and I discovered that it meant, well, they don't ever say anything but yeah and huh. They never say, yes, sir. So I got to thinking about that a little bit, and I got to thinking about the kids that I know and the ones that I live with, and I said to myself, how would I get a kid to say, yes, sir? And would that show respect? Hmm. I could make him. I'll make him say, yes, sir. Well, I knew a school like that once where they made the kids say, yes, sir, and yes, ma'am. Now, in those schools, every time that the bell rang, the teachers would come out in the hall and stand like state patrolmen. And uh, not only did the kids say, yes, sir, but I, I feel like they almost, they were supposed to salute and uh, to show respect. But I talked to a kid that went to that school once, and as I said something to him, he looked at me with the biggest snarl I've ever seen this side of an animal and said, sir. I'll tell you the truth. I would rather that he had said to me, huh, than to say, sir. Because when a kid looks you in the eye and says, sir, it seems to me he wins uh, the wrong battle. You know, it's the same kind of thing that we have with people wanting to make a person feel compassionate. You say you're sorry, now apologize. And we think if we make them say, I'm sorry, that they felt the concern, they felt the hurt, they felt the problem and the trouble that they caused another. You know it isn't true. And sometimes it's, well, at least you could do is say, pardon me or excuse me. That by saying excuse me or pardon me, uh, you would appreciate that a person has a right to be there and his legs have a right to be in the aisle. How would you get a person to develop respect, to feel compassion, to be polite, I think there's only one way that I know of because there's only one thing that kids learn anyway, and that is what's happening to them. Do you excuse yourself when you interrupt two kids talking? Pardon me, I'd like to talk with you a minute. Do you say, uh, but please, when you speak to your own son and daughter, do you show respect? Do you care? They'll learn how to do it by watching you do it to them.